It's gonna be a beautiful presentation. We're gonna put some Danos on it. We'll put that sauce right up in there, just like that. Good trip to Flavor Town. That's what I'm talking about. That really is good. Oh, damn. I see big. Oh, damn. That's good. So you basically take your giant lobster tail and you squeeze it to crack the interior of it. We just start right here and we just cut right down the spine. This is super easy. You can sometimes do it with a knife, but these are pretty, uh, pretty thick shells. So you can see as I cut all the way down to the tail and then we can open it up. And the reason why we crack that bottom part is because if you don't do that, this meat's gonna be really hard to pull out. So you can see I can go in here and I can pull it out really easy. And that cracking that inside helps it separate. And this is how you make a beautiful presentation for lobster tail. So you pull it out, not all the way out. Now you take your lobster tail, push it back together like so, and you lay it right over the top. And that's how we're gonna throw it on the grill. It's gonna be a beautiful presentation. We're gonna put some Danos on it. Then over here, we're gonna make our lemon juice, our butter, our Danos, super easy. First thing I'm gonna do is melt the butter on the grill. We're gonna take our spicy Danos. You can go Danos original that I keep on my hip, or you can go spicy Danos. What we're gonna do is we're not gonna go too hard on it because we're getting ready to make this, this uh, sauce and we're gonna put Danos in that with lemon juice and butter. So we're gonna take the spicy Danos and we're getting ready to sprinkle it on our fish and on our lobster and then we'll continue basting as it continues to cook on the grill. So, just like so, spicy Danos, we'll let that pop, pop, that trigger finger, we just hit it just like that. I'm not gonna go too hard on it, but I am gonna put a good coating, for sure. You're not gonna overdo it. Just flavor, y'all. Ready to go on the grill. Let's put these lobster tails on. There we go. Oh yeah. Got our butter melted there. Almost there. Almost there. We're gonna go meat side down. Now, we're gonna make our sauce. So we got one stick of unsalted melted butter. So we're gonna take us some lemon juice and we're just gonna add us about two lemons worth, as you can see. Now, it's where the magic happens. And we're gonna thicken this up. We're gonna take the spicy Danos, and we're gonna sprinkle it in there, quite a bit of it. I know it looks like a lot, but once we mix it around like so, it'll thicken up, and we'll use this as our basting sauce right before we pull everything off the grill. See how we get that nice and thick, that good consistency. It's not just real runny, that seasoning thickens it right up. Plus, if you let it sit without any heat for a little while, that butter will thicken up too but that's gonna be awesome on the lobster and on the fish. You know what Dano's made with, Dano? Love. Look at that. I'm telling you what, that's looking damn tasty. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be damn good, my friend. That's what I'm talking about. That's real flavor right there, y'all. Real flavor. If you want to take it one step further, because you got all that Dano's flavor on there, we can throw it upside down and get like a char on it. Then we'll take it another step further and we'll put that sauce right up in there just like that. Now, you're taking it seriously. Good trip to Flavor Town. That, my friends changing the world goodness. Let's get us a little bite here. Look at that, it comes right off the skin. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, dang. That's dang dead. That really is good. Mmm. Wow. I impressed myself sometimes. Here we go, coming in hot, dude. Pick, pick up that plate for me. So we put them back on there and charred the top of them. Look at that. It might not sit pretty. I'm telling you what. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. That's gonna be fantastic, my friends. Fantastic. Here we go. We're gonna try the lobster now, baby. Cut it right off the tail. Look at that. Look how big that is. That is a giant lobster tail. So let's just cut this up in some little bites. Oh yeah. Mm-mm. Yeah. Juice. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh man. I'm telling y'all, that sauce made with Danos is hard to beat. Super hard to beat. It's so packed full of flavor with a little butter, the little lemon. That flavor, the spicy Danos. Mmm. It's damn good, y'all, for real. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe because we are just now really starting to put together some really nice videos. This is still one of our first, and we hope to keep bringing you flavor into your kitchen, into your lives. You can bring it into your family's lives. The beautiful thing about Dano's, we got two flavors, original and spicy. It's always low sodium, no sugar, no chemicals. There's the original right here. Toss me that bottle over there, too thick. Yeah, toss me that one. That's actually all the salt that's in the whole entire bottle. Real sea salt. It's only 50 milligrams per serving. That's why it's low sodium. And that's also why when you see us use it, we can use it very aggressively because we're putting a lot of flavor into the food. No sugar, no chemicals. It's 100% real natural herbs and spices. It's the beautiful thing about it. There's nothing like it on the market. You don't know till you Dano. It's damn good. It's Dano Mike. It might just be the best Dan seasoning you ever had. Oh, damn. I see big Oh, damn. That's damn good.